Have you ever wondered why China is often at the forefront of bridge construction around the world? It's a story that begins centuries ago, rooted in a rich history of architectural prowess. Before starting the video subscribe to Tech Buy World, and praise the bell icon China's earliest known bridges, like the Zhaozhou Bridge, were not only marvels of their time, but continue to stand as testaments to the ingenuity of ancient Chinese engineers. With their unique, arch-based designs, these bridges have weathered the test of time and nature, standing tall and proud to this day. As we move through the timeline of Chinese bridge construction, the evolution is truly remarkable. The bridges of today, such as the awe-inspiring Danyang Kunshan Grand Bridge, have evolved from simple stone and wood structures to the longest bridge in the world, spanning over a hundred miles. The milestones achieved in Chinese bridge construction are a testament to the country's relentless pursuit of architectural excellence. Now, let's compare China's bridge-building achievements with those of other nations. While China stands out, other countries also have impressive bridge construction records. Crossing over to the West, the United States boasts an iconic symbol of architectural prowess, the Golden Gate Bridge. Stretching across the entrance of the San Francisco Bay it's more than just a passage between two points. It's a testament to human ingenuity, standing strong since 1937. Across the pond the United Kingdom presents a distinct piece of architectural marvel, the Tower Bridge. It's not just a bridge, it's a symbol of London, an embodiment of the country's rich history. Crafted in the Victorian Gothic style, the Tower Bridge marries functionality with aesthetic appeal, an approach that is quintessentially British. Now let's take a quick trip to France, home to the Milau Viaduct, the tallest bridge in the world. Soaring over the Tarn River Valley, it's a sight to behold. Its sleek design and incredible height are a testament to France's innovative approach to bridge construction. It combines elegance, functionality, and boldness, reflecting the country's flair for design and engineering. These countries each bring something unique to the table when it comes to bridge construction. The United States emphasizes durability and strength creating structures that withstand the test of time. The United Kingdom leans towards design that's steeped in history, achieving a blend of practicality and beauty. Meanwhile, France pushes the boundaries with daring designs and advanced engineering techniques. In terms of materials these countries also differ. The Golden Gate Bridge for instance, is a feat of steel and concrete, while the Tower Bridge combines stone, granite, and steel. The Malau Viaduct on the other hand, showcases the capabilities of steel and concrete in creating a lightweight yet strong structure. Each country's approach to bridge construction reflects their culture, values, and technological advancements. These bridges are more than just structures, they are national symbols, embodiments of human achievement, and tributes to engineering prowess. Clearly, while China leads in bridge construction, other countries also have significant contributions. The world of bridge construction is indeed a diverse and fascinating one, and we've only just scratched the surface. So, what does China's dominance in bridge construction mean for the rest of the world? Well, let's dive right in. China's bridge-building prowess has been nothing short of extraordinary, and its influence on global engineering and architecture is profound. The country's advanced techniques and innovative designs are not just admired but are being adopted by engineers and architects globally. From the lofty heights of the Danyang Kunshan Grand Bridge to the stunning architecture of the Lupu Bridge, China has set a high bar in the realm of bridge construction. But the impact goes beyond just engineering and aesthetics. Economically, China's bridge projects have been instrumental in stimulating the country's domestic growth. Massive infrastructure projects like these create jobs, spur economic activity, and improve connectivity within the country. Furthermore, China's bridge building is not confined to its borders. In countries from Africa to South America, China has been involved in constructing bridges, contributing to local economies, and enhancing connectivity. These projects often come with financial aid packages from China, fostering economic ties and diplomacy. On a social level these bridges are not just physical connectors they're also symbolic of China's role as a global connector, knitting together communities and economies. The impact of China's bridge dominance is multifaceted and far-reaching. It's not just about bridges, it's about economic progress, diplomatic ties, and global influence. China's influence in bridge construction has undeniably shaped the world in significant ways. In summary, China's bridge construction prowess is truly unparalleled. We've journeyed through its rich history in bridge construction, marveled at the comparison with other countries, and gauged its global impact. 
The Chinese have not only built bridges of concrete and steel, but also bridges of understanding and cooperation. From ancient times to modern days, China's bridge-building legacy continues to inspire and influence the world. It's a testament to the country's enduring commitment to progress and innovation.